Okay, everybody, welcome back to the flip class. Okay, today we're going to do a quick review of converting customary measurements. So going from one form of measurement to another, going from feet to inches, going from uh, yards to inches, yards to miles, etc. You get the idea, okay? Uh, but first, yep, you guessed it. Got a brain teaser for you. Okay, you have nine toothpicks. How can you make ten without breaking any of the toothpicks or adding more toothpicks? I'll give you a little bit of a hint. Read the question very carefully. Okay, let's jump right into it. This is from our book. This is on page 488, and it is the Common Customary measure, Measurement Conversion Chart. And I'm going to show you a couple of different ways if you want to convert from one, uh, one form of measurement to another, just how to do that, okay? So let's say we wanted to convert 93 inches to feet, okay? We want to know how many feet 93 inches is, okay? Well, we're going to take 93 inches. We're going to multiply that by, we know that one foot is in 12 inches, okay? So we're going to do the multiplication. Now, we know that the inches are going to cancel each other out here. So basically, we end up with 93 times 1, okay, because we're multiplying by a fraction, 93, denominator stays the same. So we have 93 divided by 12. I'm not going to do the division here. I've done it on my calculator. We will do the division in class so you can kind of see what it looks like. I just want to save a little bit of time on the video. 93 divided by 12 is going to give you 7.75. So 93 inches is equal to 7.75. 0.75 feet. Okay, let's try another one. If I told you we want to convert two pounds to ounces, okay, well, I'm going to write two pounds, multiply that by 16 ounces in one pound, okay, the pounds cancel out. 2 times 16 is 32. Denominator is 1. We know that any number over 1 is a whole number. So 32 over 1 is 32. So 2 pounds is equal to 32 ounces. Okay, I want to show you a different way to do it now. Let's say we wanted to convert from yards to feet. Okay? Yards to feet. We can make a chart, okay? One yard, I know, is three feet. Two yards, therefore, since I know that it's one times three to equal three, I'm going to multiply by three here, which would give me six feet. If I said three yards, I know three times three would be nine feet. So in three yards, there are nine feet. So if this is my number in, I know that over here, it's going to be 3 times n. So any number I gave you, if I said how many uh, feet are in 8 yards, well, if I, uh, if I have 3 n and n equals 8, I know that's going to be 24 feet. Okay, that's all I have for you for right now. Uh, make sure you have your book. Page 488 is what we're going to be looking at, and we're going to be doing many more conversions in class. Okay, I'll see you then.